Hi everyone, I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2021 Topps Chrome Formula One uh, Random Team Number One. This is a three box break featuring one box of hobby and two boxes of uh, light. Big thanks to this group right here for getting into the action. There's all the F1 teams right there, some combos with the F2 teams. And let's roll it, randomize it. Five and a four, nine times. One. Two, three, four, five, and a four. Six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. We got Tamoya down to Canard. Five and a four, nine times for the teams. Two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. We've got Haas down to Alfa Romeo. And here's how it shakes out. So Tomoy, you've got the Haas plus F2 Doms and Trident. Tomoy also has Mercedes, AMG. Peter with Renault, BWT, a couple F2 teams. Uh, Brian with AlphaTari. Tomoy with McLaren. Brian with Williams Racing. Josh with Aston Martin. Tomoy with Alpine. Red Bull and Ferrari. And Canard with Alfa Romeo. Let's sort these by team. And while you're considering... Uh, some trades, if any. Let's see which boxes we're gonna do. I think I'm just gonna, so here's a case of light, just so we all know this is from a fresh case. So first we'll uh, select a side. So light, I don't think have, they're not guaranteed autos. I think they're just parallels. Not sure I'm gonna tell it four, and this is four and 16. I think hobby, I don't know, we'll figure it out. All right. First we'll select a side. We'll go one, two, three for the left side, four, five, six for the right side. Six, right side, so we'll save these for some other time. And then we'll cut this in half, left and right, one, two, three, four, five, six. That side. And then one, two, three for the top, Hi. and four, five, six for the bottom. What's going on? What's up, what's up? And it's three, so we'll do the top two right here. Next time, I'll just I'll just grab random boxes from our stack. And then we're picking, and then one hobby box, right? Two light, one hobby. So now let's select a hobby. Also from a fresh case right here. I don't know if there's case hits or anything like that, but but um, I'll be sure to have this hobby case and those light boxes in my studio here, so they don't get mixed up with the uh, with the others. So it's a cleaner box opening. So hobby does say look for chrome autograph cards. 
and then the light does not say that. Light just says look for look for exclusive ray wave parallels inside. All right, so one, two, three for the left column, four, five, six for the right column. We're gonna go five, right side column. And then we'll go one, two, three, four, five, six on the dice roll, and that's the one box of hobby that we'll do. And it's six, it'll be the bottom box. All right, there you have it. The hobby box and the light box, two light boxes right here. Both have four, oh, hobby has four and 18, and light has four and 16, in case you're keeping track of that at home. Everything else looks pretty much the same. All right, we're gonna pause the video, see if there's any trade. When we come back, uh, we'll have the break. Stick around, be right back. All right, trade window closed. No deals were done. That list remains the same. You can kind of see it all on one screen right there. There it is, a little small, but it's three box number one. It's a pretty much a formula, F1 mixer is what we got here, an F1 mixer. Another uh, three box break is up on the site right now, jazbeescasebreaks.com. And this is, uh, it's only an 11, 11 spot break. So this is probably one of your best odds to win one of our uh, March Madness promo spots. We just added that new promo to the site earlier, uh, earlier today. So check that out. Check out the details on jazbeescasebreaks.com. So at the end of this break, I'll re-randomize everybody's names. Name on top gets the uh, gets into the promo. I think we're starting the turn uh, the tournament promo when they're when it's down to 32 teams. So we'll have some time to uh, to fill this break. These cards are slippery. And of course, uh, all cards ship, right? Has to. Be shocked if it wasn't. Let me look at the description. And yes, all cards ship. Uh, I think Netflix, didn't they in the last day or so release the new trailer for the for their F1 documentary? Which I've not seen. I, I enjoy the sport, but I, I suppose I should try to catch up on some episodes. Some of my, my, my friends who are F1 fans and did watch the ser series say that it's a little sensationalized. I don't know if anybody has seen it. Maybe they manufacture a little more drama than... Than, is, than actually exists, but anyhow. New series is coming up, and new F1 season is coming. So I guess the new series will, will go and look at 2021 year, and the 2022 F1 season starting soon. I think I'm supporting McLaren this year. I think that's what I'm, that's what I'm gonna go with. There's a Kimi uh, Raikkonen. So that must be those ray wave parallels that are exclusive to this set. So that'll be for Alfa Romeo. That's going to go to Canard. I don't know how many of there are in here, but there's Pierre Wache. For Red Bull. There's Verstappen. And there's a checkerboard Lewis Hamilton. So that'll be for Mercedes. That's going to go to Tomoya. Nice. Verstappen over there as well. 
What a what a what a finish to that F one season. Rex, who do you say will be the first free agent to sign? In F1, you mean? In Formula 1? Now that Nikita Mazepin is not on the Haas team anymore? I don't know if they replaced that driver yet. Does anyone know what's happening there? He's Russian. The whole Russian-Ukraine thing, he was booted off the team. Another Lewis Hamilton. There'll be a lot of different inserts here. For Lewis Hamilton as well. Grand Prix parallels. Well, NASCAR did not have a lockout, nor is Formula One, but Formula One did lock out Nikita Mazepin. So, I mean, what's what's Haas going to do? That's that's what everyone's thinking as the F1 season approaches in, what, a couple weeks now? There's another Ray Wave, Alpine. Magnuson is going to take over that spot. Right. That team's still uh, in that, yeah, in that second Haas seat. Of course, uh, Schumacher is in the... He's in the uh, first seat there. Schumacher's son. That is. We got a purple Charles Leclerc. 155 out of 399. How will Ferrari do this year? And I think just like NASCAR... With, their, with NASCAR's next-gen car, I want to say that Formula One also has a new car. Or a new set of specifications or something like that. So we'll, we'll see. We'll see what happens there. There's Mick Schumacher right there. All right, first light box in the books. Charles Leclerc goes to Ferrari, and that will be for Tomoya with Ferrari. All right, next light box. Rex, look, look who's in the chat. Did Vegas have World Series odds before the lockout ended? Before it ended? I'm sure they did. I'm sure they did. But I don't know. I, I, I wasn't really paying attention to them. I'm, I'm, I'm sure they must have. I wouldn't be surprised if they had odds available beforehand. Then once the lockout happened, I think they turned it. I think they turned it. Probably, they probably turned it off to see what all the major transactions were going to be. Rex was asking me earlier, who do you think is going to be the first big major league baseball free agent? But. I think I think Vegas may wait to see if that flurry of free agency ends. I don't know. Someone look. I did see the Khalil Mack trade today as well. Bears set to trade Khalil Mack to the Chargers for what seems to be a pittance. Seems to be nothing. Of course, I think he's a big he's a big cat hit. I think he's he's paid a lot, but. Like a bit of a salary dump for the Bears. And uh, 
I, don't know, I think they th I think they thought things were gonna go a little differently when they got Khalil Mack out there. There's Charles Leclerc again. There's Lewis Hamilton. Sergio Perez, Ray Wave. So there's gonna be a flurry of activity over the next week uh, in baseball. There'll be a flurry of activity. I think the, uh, there's Mick Schumacher again for Haas. That'll be for Tamoya. And then I think the NFL calendar turns over in the next week or two, right? So then that will create another wave of, of news and transactions. So I think we're gonna have a pretty busy Sports March. The rest of March is going to be quite busy, right? There'll be a lot of, gosh, Selection Sunday for the college basketball will be this, this Sunday. Baseball activity. NFL activity. F1 starting their first, the first Grand Prix starting on like the 20th or something like that. There's Max Verstappen purple, but not numbered. I thought that might be numbered. But that goes to Red Bull. That will be for Tomoya. Tomoya has both Red Bull and Mercedes, in case you're wondering. <clears throat> right, and then NFL draft in April, I think. So yeah, so the next like four weeks, and with the term and everything, next four weeks is gonna be, it's gonna be wild. Look at that, we have Arthur in the chat, Ronbo in the chat, Rex was in the chat earlier, Joe P in the chat earlier. Charles Leclerc, these Ray Waves are pretty cool. And we've got an Esteban Ocon for Alpine, gold parallel. Who do we need next? We need like Adam Kupperman in here, Volleyball Nancy, Hiller, Eddie. And then it'd be just like five, six years ago. We got Mike Tower. Yeah, Todd Father. We got to get Todd. Where's Todd? It's George Russell, who's going to actually be with uh, Mercedes now, if I'm not mistaken. Fernando Alonso for Alpine. For stopping Latifi to 399. Lewis Hamilton Ray Wave, that's pretty cool, his car. Arthur, you broke your, how did you break your ankle, Arthur? There's Latifi for Williams Racing. That's going to go to Brian. That Lewis Hamilton Ray Wave car looks pretty slick. That's a, that's a picture from the Portugal Grand Prix. Another one for Tomoya and Mercedes. How's it going, man? Good. 
jumping out of the truck. Were you, were you like, were you trying to be like uh, Dukes of Hazard or something like that? Trying to do some stunts? All right, here's the hobby box. Hobby box has four and 18 packs as opposed to four and 16. I guess you have, I don't know if there's an autograph per box. I don't think there is, but but there are autograph possibilities in here now. Right, Jack's reminding me there, there's a hockey trade deadline in about 10 days. That was Jeff Kent, Mike Tower. Jeff Kent. Just jumped off the back of the truck thing. Do you do it all the time, I guess? It's not like, it's not like, not like you're, I guess you're not a young man anymore, Arthur. Many years have gone by now. Maybe this is the end of your jumping out of the truck days. Maybe, yeah, maybe my body's getting old, Arthur, saying, step ladder time? Oh no. I don't think Jeff Kent jumped out of a truck though, Mike Tower. I think uh, I think he's, he was cleaning his truck or something like that. And he was on like a little ladder cleaning cleaning the truck and then uh, and then like slipped or something like that. And then like got, in, got injured, broke something. Yeah, it takes it takes the right car, but yeah, you can you can, you can slide off the uh, slide across the the hood of a car. You got to be careful though. The the biggest mistake is people almost hop onto the car instead of sliding across it. That's the big mistake. Top load those a little bit later. There's just a lot of Lewis Hamiltons and Verstappens here. So Mick Schumacher to 399. And there's Marino Sato for F2 Trident Future Stars. Hollywood thinking the Cubs are going to get some free agent. Like who? Who do you think? Uh, Kevin E. was saying earlier, just hoping the Braves can sign Freddie Freeman. Huge fan. May shed a tear or two. If not, you got to think that the Braves will get that done, right? They're not going to let Freddie Freeman walk. And there's out of uh, 50. That's 16 out of 50. Mick Schumacher. Redliners insert. shot of this car right there. Cubs are going to get Correa or Trevor Story.
All right, there you go. No autograph in there. Not guaranteed a box, but are possibilities when we get into the hobby level of Formula One. And there you go, folks. That was a three-box Formula One mixer, a box of hobby, and a uh, two boxes of light. So a lot of fun parallels to chase all card ship. And this is probably one of the best odds to win a March Madness spot, our latest promo. Check out the details on jazbeescasebreaks.com. So let's gather everybody's names again. New dice, new list, name on top, just one spot being given away. Oops, so that's a different break. One spot being given away. I think some, some breaks will have multiple spots, so keep an eye out for that. Pay attention to the title. Um, so there's everybody once again. Let's roll it and randomize that list. One and a five, six times. Name on top after six in the promo. One, two, three, four, five, and a one. Five and sixth and final time. Good luck. And it's Joshua. Congrats to you, Josh. I don't think I called your number out too often this break. You had Aston Martin. I'm sure there's some Aston Martin card in here, but it wasn't like a Ray Wave or anything significant. But you're in our latest March Madness promo. Check out the details on jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.